going back to the right. We can come back and then stop on a heading in north. Sounds good. We can use that as our cardinal heading. Okay, I'm going to start leveling out now. There you go. Yeah, do it kind of early so we're not rushing up there. And, and then we're going to go to power of, you said 20? Like 21 okay. of manifold pressure, like 23. Okay. Let's see if that gets us to about 110. Sorry, 120 ish. Yeah. Cool, we're on a northerly heading. Let's make sure everything. Look at that. Look at this. There's no procession. I like that. Yeah, me too. So. We'll level off. Trim is your friend here. So we're leveling off at 5,200? Yeah, that's good enough. And we're just going to leave the props 23. Yeah. So 21, 23. And as you pull the props, your manifold might rise a little okay. bit, so come back and cross check. There's 24. All right, so we're little bit less there on that just to see what it gives us. That's pretty married up. We're 22. Now look at that, 120. 120 man. on the nut right there. Cool, that's what we want. And which way are you going on that steep turn? Uh, I'll go left. All right, cool. Watch but do this without trim. And like you said, yeah, just try to hold whatever, it. you know. And we're descending, so you're going to start getting that speed coming up. Right. And whenever you're stable. Yep. We'll go ahead and enter it. We're going to go to 50 degree get, bank. get it trimmed before I start. And this indicates 10, 20, 30, And then the 60. middle is 45, so. Is that 45? Yeah, right in the middle of those two. So 10, 20, 30, I guess it's 45. So. Yeah, in the middle of that. So a little bit more than that. All right, here we go. Clear left, coming left. Clear left, go left. And about two and a half degrees nose up will keep you where you need to be. You need to go a little bit more to 45. You're, there you go. Remember, we're smooth with those controls, not so like, just treat it like your baby and it won't do that much. All right, so we're, about 25 degrees before we go, which is about now slow and steady, not too aggressively. Nice and smooth. And actually, I cheated. I'll tell you what, man. I added the trim just because it's my habit. It worked out. That's fine. You're fine. Now your level flight. Level we're going right. to the right one. Go right. You do what you want, makes you comfortable. As long as it works, I don't care. You're going to descend a little bit if you... There you go. That's beautiful right there. So this one, you want to be just slightly above the horizon on that, on this attitude indicator. Rake it in across. Much cleaner the second time yeah, around. Yeah, you're right. I it always is that way. See how smooth you are this time? Yeah. Than you were last time? Uh, uh, point yeah, see that. right there. Keep the bank in, you're yeah. almost there. I lost it in the sun. That's all right. Now I'll start coming around. There you go. A little high on that, thank you. That's all right. All right, cool. That was good. So we'll go right into slow flight? Yeah, so before that airspeed starts jacking up, now we know we're way too fast, so we're going to go ahead and just pull the power back to about 18 inches of mercury. Well, 15 will do it. Let that 15 there because the right. RPM's there. All right. Now let's configure, get that mixture rich. Props coming full forward slowly. And I'm going to get back down to 52. And we're going to throw your fuel pumps Thank on. You. you ready? We're going to do a maneuver now, right? Okay. So that's good. We're up on red line, so we're going to pull that power back a little bit more on this aircraft. And we're coming up under 110, so, so gear, down. gear down. And we're using north, right? Gear yep. down. Just You can pull up or you can wait, get stable. I'm just going to wait and get stable for a minute. There, there you go. There's your three green. All we're right, happy I'll go there. go one notch smoothly. And that's going to take a pitch yep. up moment. Yep. And everything else is going to be a pitch down moment, right? Cool. Maintaining our... We'll stick with 5,100 okay. here. It's slowing so down. Much. There we go. Don't lose that altitude, kind of keep it in there. 
There you go. Final or just 25? You can do all the way. Look at that, coming right up. So we need 15 inches. Let me write that all down. Right. 15 inches is happy medium. Cool. Let me get back on the heading. And your altitude, you're losing it, so you're going to need... And we're right at 65. Keep that. We're climbing in slow flight. Let me get back to 5100. You're doing good. Look at that. You're sticking at your 55 on the way up. It's not very happy when you do that, right? Right. Get back to our head, and there's our altitude, so we can start pulling that power back just a smidgen and leveling off. And keep that 10 degrees of bank to get back on yeah. heading, right? Good. You still might have a little bit too much power because you're climbing and you're on speed, right? I just keep 52, you're here, that's right. Cool. Cool, now you're on speed, let it slow down just a little bit more. If you want to, let's see when the stall warning comes on. So just slowly inch that power back, maintain altitude. There it is, there you go. And then the recovery. There you go. Cool. So we're dirty. All right, so that was the stall. Let's clear that up for a second. Okay. Let's just, I just wanted to see where the stall warning. All right. So get back to 65, or 75 descent. I'll start a 500 foot per minute descent. Oh, descent, So okay. like Bob will want from you, right? We're yeah. good. We're so clear. We're on runway 36. We're going to start 500 feet a minute at 75. Yeah, miles. just, yeah. And that, probably worried right about what your power setting was right about there. Yeah, okay. that was probably good. Where are we at? 75, 80 side? knots. We're descending down. We've got about a 500 foot per minute descent, right? Yeah. Cool, everything's happy. And then you're going to level off, right? So then I say I'm going to level off at 50, or what is that, 4,800, right? Okay. So then I'll level off and not do anything. Yeah, here, you can even do it here. So there you go. Pull the power back. You're flaring. Hold, hold, hold. Power idle at, let's just, you can do it here if you want. That's fine. It's coming down. Hold, 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 hold. There it is. Horn and cover. Down. Down. Power. power. And then start the reverse. Do you go gear up, flaps reverse, up? Reverse. Flaps immediately. Then gear up and the rest Identify of it. positive rate. Right, we there got an uh, airspeed reversal. It's going down now. We don't want to go that slow. Don't pitch up that high. Now I got my positive rate. Gear up. Yeah, see how you got that reversal yeah, yeah, and let that airspeed yeah, yeah. go away again? So now it's, it's going. Now you can start cleaning it up. And watch your heading. Yeah. We're losing that. And clean it up some more now that we got good. And you got up the blue line. So what you did was you let it get the blue line, then you pitched up aggressively, and yeah. it went way back down again. All right. So we want to try to keep keep that airspeed where it's at. Once we attain a good climb, okay, and maintain that as we're cleaning it up. All right. Cool. And now we're climbing right good. So let's do a power on stall. Bring it back to like 18, 15 to 18 inches of mercury. That might be a bit much. So I guess 15 is the number in this plane. And we're going to try to get this thing stabilized. We're good. Now we're going to slowly bring it back, maintain our current altitude, and get to like a 75 rotation okay. speed. And so I like how you're slowly letting yeah. it. We're not trying to just slam it into that. We're trying to pull that power Maintain our altitude. Cool. That's rotation all right, speed, sir. right? So we go full throttle. We're taking off. Your mistress texts you, oh, crap. And what do we do? We over pitch. So get that, like, up there in that 15. Look, it's coming away. It's coming away. Just hold it right there. Look at it coming off. There it is, first indication. And then there. Oh, that's good enough. It yeah, doesn't want to do that. And then recovery. And then recover, the just horizon. reduce angle of attack. It Don't comes sink. Through. Yeah, keep it coming. You're still climbing. Yeah. And we're getting back to that 80. We're safe zone. Get back to 88, and we can, we're can. we really safe, right? All right. We're climbing away, and everyone's happy, right? Good. Very good. All right. Now we're going to pull the power back just a little bit and level off. Pull it back so you don't accelerate past 100. So okay. as you're leveling off, you're mixing that up, right? We're still climbing. So nose that over. I'm going to give you a little bit of this there. How's that? Yeah. Cool. 
Now level off, trim it out, and don't get over a hundred. Get then slowly get the airspeed back up to about a hundred. There you go, twenty. It's twenty for a hundred knots. Cool. Then what we're going to do is we're going to as we see we're at a, a nice a little bit over hundred, which is fine. So we're going to okay. roll into a bank and then pull the power off. Pull the power. So by the time we hit thirty degrees of bank, you're at idle. Okay. Keep it over to forty-five and pull it. Okay. Which way are you going? Left. Cool. Keep that coming over. Keep it coming over. Keep it coming. There you go. You're idle. Now you're here. Now pull, pull, pull. There it is. There you go. Level wings. Roll out. Cool. Good. So you just got to kind of be a little yeah. firm on it, and it'll go do it. And that's all this accelerated stall is. Cool. The MC demo, fuel pump's on. Gear up, flaps up. Right. right. We want to make sure that's good. <clears throat> all right. It's a little bit firmer on than the one we have. Yeah, it is. And we're descending. That's fine. Cool. Let's see where we're at. Here we go. Let's see. Are we happy here? Cool. So make sure it's props full forward, right? Yeah. And what we're going to do is we're going to simulate like an engine failure. Okay. And we're going to demonstrate visual BMC, right? Okay. So what are we going to do? We're going to pull that power to idle nice and slow. Now watch. Look, it's okay. Look what happens. All right, what's happening? We're trying to maintain altitude, we lost thrust, right? So we're yawing, so it's the left engine, it's an up, we have to step on the right rudder. Now, cool, we want no more than five degree bank in the up engine and have that deflection. We're losing altitude, why? Because we're above, let's go full throttle. We're gonna get that throttle, it's gonna take more rudder to do that, right? Cool, look at that, now we're gonna maintain altitude. How can we do that? We know we can go to 88, so let's just trim this thing for 88 and see if it'll let me climb a little bit. Half dot deflection. And I'm just pulling up slowly. There's about our 88. I'm losing my heading. What do we do? We just slowly bank back into it. And let it do it. There's my 88. Look, I'm not really doing much other than holding the bank. In. Right. I'm not fighting it. I have plenty of rudder left, right? And I'm descending, so I have full power. So if I'm descending, I'm drifting down, and I'm at 88, we know we're above our single engine service ceiling. Right. So now we have drift down, right? Right, right. Cool. Which is fine for VMC demo, right? We're back on south. I'm going to let that roll So back you're just in. showing right here that the, what you're getting at blue line blue on line. one engine, and you're getting yep. it about a 200 yep. foot per minute, whatever So it is. VMC demo is actually like a stall a vertical or a asymmetrical loss right or what do you call it a directional loss control and whichever comes first right look i'm getting slow so we're gonna have to let down we have full power we have nothing left we have our heading we have our half dot deflection right so now what we're gonna do is demonstrate that so how do we do that we just start slowly pitching up maintaining our heading and that half dot deflection and just gonna keep going one knot per second and any loss of directional control is when you recover. Is when you recover. Which is about 56, so we're still good. All right, I'm having trouble. A little bit of trouble. See how it doesn't want to do anything? There's the stall warning. What are we going to do? Unload the aircraft. And idle. Pull the power to about mill stop. Marry them back up again. I have my airspeed reversal. I'm now above, and we're good to go. Okay. That's all we do. Now we recover, find an altitude, get your heading, and we're done. Cruise out, and you're good to go. All right, cool. Pretty simple, not yeah. hard. But I like to go really slow. So many I, people. Yeah. We're going to do this, this, and then yeah. we're throwing everything around, sure. and you don't learn anything. And then, look, because we're going slow, hey, look, we're drifting down. And right. Those are things to kind of keep in mind. Emergency descent. Do you know how to do those? Uh, let's go ahead and demonstrate. Right, cool. Well, I do know how to do it in a single engine. Right, that's so. fine. So look what I did. I kept my power way back, right? right. So I'm not going fast. Because in between those maneuvers where we're doing stuff, I don't need to get back to 120. Too much is happening right. fast. But we're going 95 knots, which is plenty safe. Right. But it allows me to do any gear, any flap combination. What happens when the student's like, my student today, what do you want to do? You just... 
immediately. But we're talking about it. He's doing like, no, no, we're talking, then we do. Right. So then we're going to say, hey, we're going to do emergency descent. We'd make our radio call. There's nobody out here. So what do you do? We're below 108, gear down, right? Yep. Transit lights in. Cool. Everything's good. All right. So then we're going to say, oh, I got smoke in the cockpit. Someone <laughs> with their pants. We got to right. get down. Yep. So what do you do? Power idle. All right. Okay. So then what do we do? We nose over. Look how far you have to get to 120. We do subtle turns to keep the load on the aircraft. Look. Look. There's 120. There's 130, right? Then we just slowly rock. Keep that pressure in through the turn so it doesn't slow down. Coming do 90 around. degree turns? You just keep doing 90 degree turns? I just do subtle banks. Okay. Trying to get, where's our emergency landing? We're landing where? We're landing where? Everything's good. We're not letting our speed fluctuate, right? Look, see, I let it slow down because I leveled off, right? Yeah. So I got to keep that nose down. Okay. We're coming up on 2,000 feet. Let's just say that's our runway, right? Yeah. So we're keeping that 120 in. We're getting down. We're getting down. There's 2,000. We're going to keep it in, keep it in, keep it in, keep it in. We're coming up to 1500, we're slowing down. We're transitioning to land, so slow the aircraft down. There we go. All right, we're say this is a simulated emergency landing. All right, there we go, flaps, pitch, right? And you said flaps. the speed is 120, right? Yeah. So now just 90, 90, just till you're yep. trying to kill that out. There's my 88. Okay, keep it at 88. All right, I'm gonna give it some power because we're descending rapidly still, so we're gonna add power to stop that from happening. Keep my speed at 80 because it's approach. There's my final pitch. We're still around 80. We're descending too fast, so we add a little bit of power because we want to descend nice and slow. Right. And then we're going to line up on our field. Now that we flew the aircraft first, now we can get realigned with where we're going to land. We're a little fast now, so we're going to go ahead and slow it down. We're coming down. We're a 1,000 feet. All right. Three Tango Juliet, go around, go around. Okay. Go around power. Pitch. Power. Flaps. Advancing up. Flaps immediately. And then. Airspeed reversal. Positive rate gear up. Cool, we're coming up. We got 88, we're good. We'll start cleaning up at the same time. Flaps down like this. A little bit more flaps. Let the airspeed, we're having to climb away. And there was your go around. Come back down to your cruise power setting and maneuver complete, cruise it out, get back to whatever altitude you want to be at. That's simple, all right? But always pick a landing area if you're right. doing this, right?